The most common health issues for Labrador Retrievers Labrador Retrievers are beloved family dogs with amazing personalities. These popular dogs are friendly and hardworking and contribute to human society in amazing ways. From guiding, guarding and detecting, these beautiful dogs love to get to work and they thrive on helping others. However, Labrador Retrievers can experience a range of health issues and in this video, we'll take a look at them. Note that not all Labrador Retrievers will have any or all of the following conditions. Before we get started, please help us out by subscribing to our channel and don't forget to ring that bell to see our frequently posted content. If your pup does experience any ailments or symptoms referenced within this video, we highly recommend seeking advice from your local professionals. Did you know you can now visit brooklynscorner.com to find local vets in your area? On average, Labrador Retrievers measure between 21 to 24 inches at the shoulder and weigh between 55 to 80 pounds. Their lifespan is between approximately 10 to 12 years. Number 1. Hip Dysplasia Hip dysplasia is hereditary and a result of the thigh bone not fitting snugly into the hip joint. Some dogs show pain or lameness in their leg when they suffer from this condition, but others don't show symptoms at all. High calorie diets and injuries caused by jumping can worsen this inherited condition and it can lead to arthritis in older age. 2. Elbow Dysplasia This condition is hereditary for larger dogs and thought to be caused by the dog's bones growing at different rates. Elbow dysplasia can lead to pain and lameness. The condition can be managed with medication and weight loss or your vet may suggest surgery. Number 3. Progressive Retinal Atrophy PRA. This is a family of eye diseases that can cause night blindness in severe cases. Many affected dogs learn to adapt well if their surroundings stay the same. Number 4. Patella Luxation This condition is also known as slipped stifles and is common in smaller dogs. This condition is a result of the patella not being lined up properly and can cause lameness or an abnormal gait in affected dogs. Patella luxation is present in dogs at birth but mightn't show up until much later. There are five grades of patella luxation, ranging from grade 1, which includes occasional luxation and temporary lameness, to grade 5, where a dog is bow-legged and requires surgery. Number 5. Diabetes As in humans, canine diabetes is a disorder where the body can't regulate blood sugar levels. Dogs with diabetes will eat more food to compensate, but will lose weight. Signs of diabetes include thirst, increased appetite, weight loss, and excessive urination. It can be controlled with diet and daily insulin injections. Number 6. Cataracts Cataracts is an eye condition that causes opacity on the lens of the eye, leading to poor vision and the appearance of a cloudy eye. Cataracts are more common in old age and can sometimes be surgically repaired. 7. Hyperthyroidism as in humans, hyperthyroidism is the result of excess thyroxine produced by the thyroid gland. This excess causes a variety of health and metabolic issues. Symptoms in dogs include unexplained weight loss alongside an increase in appetite, shortness of breath, and breathing irregularities. Number 8. Obesity Some dog breeds are more at risk from obesity because they absolutely love their food. Labrador Retrievers are one of these breeds, and they simply can't get enough. Because of this, labs can become overweight very quickly. To avoid this, make sure your lab is getting plenty of exercise and measure out their meals to make sure they aren't getting too many calories. Number 9. Epilepsy Epilepsy is a neurological condition that is often, but not always, inherited. Dogs with this condition experience mild to severe seizures. Number 10. Gastric Dilatation Volvulus Also known as bloat, this condition can affect large, deep-chested dogs. Bloat occurs when a dog's stomach is distended and then twists, preventing the dog from belching or vomiting. This causes a drop in blood pressure, causing the dog to go into shock. The chances of bloat are higher if dogs are fed one meal a day, eat quickly, drink a lot of water after eating, or exercise a lot after eating. Symptoms of bloat include a distended abdomen, excessive salivating, and retching but not vomiting. Well, that's all from us. Thanks for tuning in to learn the most common health issues for Labrador Retrievers. We hope it helped. 
be sure to subscribe and paw that thumbs up button. Then go ahead and check out some of our other videos or fun activities on our website. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.